Ew. So, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Oh, I did not brush my teeth today. I did not brush my teeth today. Ooh, that's crazy. Um, well, I'm back. Um, and I'm just pretty much making this YouTube video to showcase my 2006 Hyundai Santa Fe. Um, yes, I'm here to showcase my 2006 Hyundai Santa Fe. Um, I just bought a car. Um, you know, if I'm going to be honest, you know, I like my car. I think it's nice. I think it's unique. I think it fits me. I definitely want to do a lot of traveling with this car. Um, that's my goal for the new year is to do a, like a lot of traveling in this car. I want to get it fixed. Um, maybe I should show you guys around. So this is her. Isn't she a beauty? Isn't she like the best car ever? So this is pretty much the front of her, you know? Nothing too crazy. Just, you know, just uh, living her best life over here in the projects. So pretty much uh, the whole thing about this video was to pretty much say that um, I'm planning on traveling a lot this year. That's definitely going to be my goal. I'm not going to like say it and then not do it. I definitely want to travel. I definitely, I definitely want to see some things. Um, because of the simple fact that I hate living in America right now currently. And I want to do something different than most people. I want to be like an on-road traveler. I want to go see the fucking stars and stuff. I want to take some mushrooms and, you know, live my best my best life on the road because I'm not a worker and you know I don't think I will ever be a worker I think I'm the type of soul and spirit who likes to go see stuff I want to go experience stuff I want to go talk to a camera you know I want to live pretty much rent free and I really don't want to live I really don't want to live a life of like regret pretty much I really just want to like live my best life completely um on the road you know i want to be a i want to be a traveler i want to be an explorer i want to go see some stuff i want to go be interesting with other people i want to go see what other people are talking about you know that's that's my thing that's my goal that's my life you know that's my life <sighs> that is my my life okay so in the middle of me cleaning my bathroom i just thought about something I thought about the fact that in America, ooh, please don't see my bathroom. Let me just keep you right here. Let me keep you, let me keep you stationed right here. You know what I'm saying? Oh my God. The difficult thing about living in America is they pretty much push, like if you're a cre creative person or like, let's say for instance, you have a creative talent or you're like an overly, you know, a creative person and you have a creative mindset, they pretty much tell you, this is not the government, but it's just programmed into people's brains that, you know, oh, you're a dancer or, oh, you're a writer or you're an artist. As long as you're not a Michael Jackson or a Beyonce or, a, a, you know, um, freaking was one of these very creative artists or whatever whatever they are pretty much like if you're not overly extraordinary you have to still work like they pretty much like unless you can prove yourself to them unless it's like something they can tangible that's tangible that they can like clearly see even if they see it sometimes they still force this idea on you that you have to work a nine to five and you know, I find that pretty crazy. So, it is the next day um, since the last time I recorded my last clip, I believe. Um, and here's the good thing about this whole YouTube journey thing that I'm trying to do right now. Ooh, that's just a whole thing of shit right there. Let me step around that. The good thing about this whole YouTube thing I'm trying to do is everything's going to come in like segments you know i'm not going to just like do 
you know, one idea because so much happens in my life on a daily basis that sometimes I just need multiple days to record. And this is just one of those times where I just need multiple days to record because I don't really know what this YouTube video is gonna be about, but I'm gonna figure it out with you guys. And I, hopefully you guys can take a lot of messages and a lot of um, wisdom from these YouTube videos that I'm trying to record. So pretty much today, I feel, I feel, liberated you know i feel sick um i feel like i'm going towards the life that i want i feel like this is my moment um to shine let it shine let it shine you know i feel like this is the time where I'm resting, you know, and I was I was saying yesterday, pretty much, I was like, you know, I don't want to feel bad for resting, you know, for having needing time for myself, you know, I don't want to feel bad for needing time to myself to reflect on on things, you know, like, I feel like even the people who you know, like the personal trainers, they tell you that the most important days are not the days that you're working out. The most important days are the days that you're resting. And I am taking time for myself to rest, to clear my mind, to clear my consciousness, um, to clear my air, to, to purify myself, you know, to go in nature, to look around. You know, this, 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 this is living, you know, not going to work every day, um, not stressing myself out with life and its problems. This is living, being in nature, hanging out with friends, you know, making friends, you know, hanging out with family, um, doing things like that. So this, this is my definition of living, you know? What is life? I think that's the biggest question we all have. What is life, you know? What's the purpose of life? And I've just came to the conclusion that I probably will never know my purpose in life, but I'll just have to continue to do the things that I want to do. And I have to just do things one step at a time because this is my purpose, you know, to keep going, to, to keep doing the things that I enjoy doing, you know, making music, recording music videos, going out in nature, smoking weed, you know, popping shrooms every once in a while. This is, these are the things that I like to do. I'm also, if you haven't noticed in my videos, I've been wearing bonnets and do-rags and things like that because I'm growing out my dreads. I'm growing out my dreads. And I was a little, um, I was a little skeptical on telling people about it because I didn't know how people were going to react because I used to have dreads, but I cut my dress off because I was extremely stressed out and depressed around the time and I didn't know how to like cope with it. So I thought cutting my dress off would like release energy. And I'm not gonna lie, I think now that I look back at it, it kind of did release energy. It, it put me on a new path, you know? Um, I definitely say if I still had my dress to this day, I probably would look way better. <laughs> You know, and that's just one of my insecurities right now. You know, my looks is one of my biggest insecurities right now because I don't feel at my most confident right now currently. But I'm getting back. I'm getting myself back, though. You know, I'm restarting, you know, and this is the time of which I need to do that. Like last year was such a such a mm, it was such a moment for me. You know, it was such a mental, spiritual moment for me and i just needed time to think and cutting my hair off definitely gave me time to think so this year i am growing my dreads back you won't see them right now i'm gonna wait until they get like at least down here until i start showcasing them but right now they're being pampered really really bad you know i'm trying to retwist them every other day i'm trying to keep them moisturized like i'm trying to grow my hair to be the most beautiful dreadlock and to see in the world, you know, 
that's the that's the goal that's the purpose that's the meaning of life growing dreads sitting around watching tv sometimes playing my video game and enjoying my life and going out in nature looking around cussing out my dog that's the type of stuff that makes me happy that is my life this is pop the smoke segment of the video what do you think about all of that sir oh i thought that was very inspirational i love you i love you dog hmm okay time to go in the house now okay so you can eat all the food do you want to eat all the food all right let's go